Hello everybody, welcome back. This is Milnar, and we're once again in Red Dead Redemption. It's an overcast uh, day out, but uh, we got some stuff to do. So first off, we're going to head back to town real quick. There's somebody wants to talk to us there, so we'll, we'll ride our way out there. Nice little deer. I'll do some hunting later on down the road after we move through some of the quests here. You may have noticed uh, the last episode kind of started weird. Um, and we missed two or three quests for Bonnie. Which, they weren't major quests, but... Hey. Don't know what that all was all about, but they didn't like me, so. Can I have this? I'll go ahead and take what they have. That's a good way to get money. Don't mind me, sir. It's there. Might as well take it. You stink. We'll use it for later. his body. There we go. I could take that to town. But I don't want to. I don't remember any uh, place to turn in. Doesn't mean that there isn't a place. I just don't remember a place. And this one is going to continue a quest that we had a while ago. So we're going to do this one real quick before we go after Wilbur. How do you do? Hey! Hello there! Mister! She's gone! Who is? My wife! She's gone! She went out picking mushrooms in the hills. They're hanging rock and they got her. The stories are true. <laughs> <laughs> What'd the police do about it? <laughs> oh, about as much as you'd expect. <laughs> Made me fill out a form. <laughs> Beryl ain't strong, but she's a good girl. I'll see what I can do. <laughs> 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 Okay, we gotta go back out to Hanging Rock, so that's up this way in this area. Again, back out here with the appetites. A lot of things happen out here. I still gotta figure that map out here, too. I know it's somewhere out this way. Don't try to steal my horse from me, buddy. 
I'll take you out. What you got on you, friend? Down to the rubble tracks and all of them. Let's go! Out of the border, it's not really rubble tracks, they're just borders. Same sightings as last time. Oh, this one's an arm arm. Now we completed this piece out, but it's still more to go, it says. We need to go down to Wilbur. We're going to do it through Hanging Rock. I want to take a peek at this again. Come on. Now you don't want to run into cactuses like that. That would. Okay. One is the rock and inside the stone, so off the horse here. There's gotta be a path in this stone, but I thought there was. Ah, there it is. One chest complete. Would you looky here? Money and a map. Or a letter. Okay, this one is O Reed Gelo Lobo. You gotta look around for a spot. So I gotta Rio de Lobo. Gotta find that campsite. I think I know where that's at. I think if I remember correctly. I'm thinking it's somewhere right around here. When we're riding through here, yeah, right here. There's a stranger there, but I think this is Rido Lobo. Got another stranger there. So we got a couple things, but we're going to go ahead and head towards this stranger and then down to Wilbur. Or whatever his name is. Come on, baby. Get over here. Come on. Oh, 
come over this way. Oh, nice little deer there. Whoa, we'll go down this way. Perk's back over here. Let's go. What are you doing in this old burnout house, sir? Ma'am? Yes, it's ma'am. Okay. Hello, ma'am. Dear, oh dear. Everything all right, madam? It's miss. Oh. Oh, let me look at you. My gentleman caller. You remind me of my Peter. Have you seen him? I don't think yep. so. Where is that man? We'll be late for the ceremony. He must still be at the saloon in Armadillo, talking to the musicians. He's such a fine man. Must be making things right for me, as usual. Well, I gotta get going, ma'am. I'm sure your Peter will be just fine. Wait, I beg you. Would you possibly go fetch him for me? This was meant to be my perfect day. Please, sir. Something must have happened. I can't bear it. I think you've been stilted. So you want me to go find your Peter so you can have a perfect day? Yes, please, sir. I'll see what I can do. Oh. Okay. I also saw better days, that's for sure. Come on. I haven't even looked in the gunsmith yet. Come through, sir. What brings you in here, All right. Well, well. Just so you know, I don't take requests, mister. I'm looking for a man. Name's Peter. The fellas meant to get married today. Seen him around? Who? Peter, is what she said. <laughs> you ain't after no Pete Turner, are you? For all I know, where can I find him? Well, my memory escapes me when not properly stimulated. Well, let's see if we can refresh it. Five dollars will do. Or you could run a little errand for me. What do you need done? It's my wife. She packed her things this morning and left me. <laughs> the dumb wench is still at the freight station waiting for the stagecoach. If you could convince her to take me back. Her name's Rose. I guess I'll go have a talk with her. Now you'll need more than talk with that bitch. You wonder why she left you. Hey, lady. Keep on going. Okay, we gotta go to stagecoach. I can't wait to get it. Excuse me, miss? Er Rose? If that useless whoremongering bastard sent you, get lost! Miss, please. If only You know what? Tell that bastard I ain't going back. Not this time. Not even at gunpoint. You sign an oath, miss. For better or worse. The way I see it, you should give him one last chance. Stop bothering me, you dumb cowpoke, or I'll call the marshal. Well, you sure ain't no gentleman, are you? 
Sure, I'll go back to him, but trust me, there same as God, I'll kill him when he's asleep. That's your business, madam, and I wish you luck with it. He was too yellow to come and get me himself, is he? I'll poison that little maggot. What did he do? What didn't he do? He's a fiddler who can't stop fiddling. Ain't a woman in armadillo he ain't had his sweaty paw. He says he wants you back. Truth is, Pete Turner ain't been an armadillo for near on 20 years now. Kind of a queer fella and all. Wasn't here every night, sure as the moon in the sky. What happened to him? Well, <laughs> what happens to all of us? I reckon you'll find him at Odd Fella's Rest. Yeah, that's where he'd be, I guess. Hmm. I'm gonna look upstairs here. I saw something outside. Yeah, there's an X here. Why is there an X here? Slow it down, will you? I doubt that you meant to do that, sir. Something you buy. 50 bucks. Don't know what it is. I'm not spending 50 bucks yet. So where is Old Fella Rest is out this way, huh? Come on. Hello, uh, stagecoach. What's coming on through? Is this a cemetery or something out here? We shall see. I have someone who's that little owl, owl timers and her hubby already married her and then got old age and passed away and she's not catching on to it. Could be wrong. Oh, whatever. They're all cool. Oh, somebody we gotta save? Okay. I'll come save you. Didn't do too well, but let's go ahead. What you got on you, friend? Take everything. We didn't do a good job. One guy just ran too fast up there. I don't think there was anything we could have done. But oh, well, get back our uh, stuff. Out of curiosity, we're good on that. Okay, that skull symbol. Oh, I want a poster. Let's go. Oh, it's there when we're done with this, Aaron. We'll. out and see if that one to post still there. I missed the one because I waited too long. But this happens with this one it does. Good way to make a little extra of money and fame. I kinda like to stay with what I thought it's a cemetery.
Peter Turner. Yep. Okay, need to go back and talk to her, don't we? Every time disappeared, we got somebody down the road here. Come on. Come on, let's go check this out real quick. You okay, ma'am? Howdy, miss. Uh, what are you doing out here? Um, I'm thinking. Have I seen you before? Oh, uh, yes, I think so. On the train from Blackwater, perhaps. Yeah. Yeah, you were talking with the preacher. Yes, sir, I was. I don't know if it's so safe out here, miss. Oh, Jenny. You can call me Jenny. Uh, uh, all right. Uh, I'm safe because I, I have faith. So uh, faith can move mountains. That's the whole point. Did you have trying faith, to move a mountain? Oh, no. Uh, I can't do anything. But with faith, I can achieve great things. I know that. I know it. You want me to take you back into town, ma'am? You seem kind of unwell. Oh, I, I get such clarity out here. I see things purely. The world is so beautiful. And full of things that'll kill you. <laughs> including illness. Nothing's gonna kill me, sir. Well, take care then. Do I have any medicine on me? Uh, let's see. Ooh. Let's bring her some medicine. Miss Jenny. <coughs> Miss Jenny. Don't look like the Almighty's much inclined to help you out here. I was kind of worried about you, so I brought you some medicine. Save me. <coughs> Excuse me? You see, <laughs> it was only through his will that you were ordered to save me. Tell me, <coughs> were there angels in your vision? Jenny, uh, can I take you back into town? Praise you, Savior. I knew you'd save me. <coughs> will you come with me? Oh, I'm fine here, mister. <laughs> I'm in heaven. <coughs> heaven. <coughs> okay. Gonna wash your hands of her, huh? Okay, before we go do Wilbur. Come on. Or Williams or whatever he is. We're gonna go back to town. Out of everybody else's way. Because I want to go back to town. Right here, I want to go ahead and grab this wanted poster. Oh, 
gonna be tired of all this running back and forth. Hither and thither. Right there, buddy. Hey, grab this poster and then we'll go. Go. Okay, we're gonna go down this way. American way. Come on out here and let me protect myself. Hey, partner. We got the Second Amendment for a reason, don't we? Hmm, double barrel shotgun. You believe anything I say because I'm white. Hmm. Business is what keeps this country great. Fine transaction. I'm thinking that were mutually beneficial. I didn't see what. So I got a carbine and a cattle rifle. Anything you need, just holler. Howdy, friend. Nope, we can't put no price on safety. <laughs> I think I'm going to hold off a little bit. What's this do? This one might be good to get, though. I think that's good for now. Oh, I can carry more ammo, but I think with what I got, I'm good, good evening, for the moment. Listen, okay. I wanted to get some medicine, that's why I didn't want to spend everything. Hello, friend. I'm selling some good tonics if you need them. Any trouble, let me know. That'll do me. Okay, there we go. Stay away from the top portion of that. Now let's uh, see where we have to go for this bounty. Right down to there. Yeah. Let's go do the bounty real quick. Try to at least. Right him. Before we go all the way to that bounty, I'll just take a look here, see how close we are. We got a little bit of distance. We're going to talk to this guy while we're here. Yeah! Load up now! Well, howdy! Excuse me, friend. Mind if I rest up at your camp a spell? Well, it'd be my pleasure. Man needs a break from this desiccated land. Thank you, mister. Mm. Say, what's that stick you got there? 
Oh. Y'all ain't never seen a dowsing rod before, mister? Never seen a man summon the water up from the bare earth? Uh, mister, uh... Marston. Ah. No, can't say I have. Hmm. It's water you're looking for. What's wrong with that lake over there? Oh, there ain't nothing wrong with Lake Don Julio. Nothing wrong with it, but we lack the fancy irrigation equipment <laughs> you folks have back east, so... Man needs a wellspring on his proper tie to ranch here. Makes sense. Yeah. Why, you know, just last week, I was over at Old Pleasant's house. Now, I think I may have found something, but... Old Coot that owns the place threatened to call the law down on me, so... People act funny around strange men with sticks. They sure do. Damn fools. Bet you he don't even know how much water's running underneath his proper tie. You want me to tell him? <laughs> you know what? You ain't that stupid, mister. And I can tell. I'll tell you what. Why don't you go get the old man to sell us his proper tie for a small pittance? Then I can find the source of the water, build us a proper wellspring. Maybe I will. Well, all right then. <laughs> Okay, we'll add that to our list of things to work on. But I think that's all we've got time for today. We're going to come over this come way on. and we're going to put out a little camp and while away the day. So with that, I hope you enjoyed this adventure we had today while we settled down by the old campfire. Give me that like button if you did. And if you're new to the channel, mosey on up and hit that subscribe button and we will see you on the next one.